Welcome to The Terrible Take, a daily segment telling Steelers Nation what's on our mind. I'm Alex Kazora. Monday night's game was all about Calvin Austin. A two-touchdown performance, a 73-yard punt return, and 29-yard catch to account for both of the Steelers' touchdowns. His season has not been about volume, but he's maximized opportunity. Austin is averaging over 18 yards per catch and nearly 13 yards per return. Quality, not quantity. And it's just a feel-good story. A walk-on at Memphis who made a name for himself in college. A fourth-round pick whose rookie season was wiped out by a foot injury, extra concerning because his game was built around speed. But even in 2023, it was abundantly clear those wheels were still as fast as ever. Last year was a tough season and one of football's worst passing offenses, and he did little on offense the back half of the season. This year has been spotty, but it's been explosive with long touchdowns against the Chargers and the pair Monday night. Austin has been a diligent worker who takes pride in details, blocking despite his size, finishing plays, growing and getting better as the offseason progressed as wide receivers coach Zach Azani once attested to. Now, I've certainly had my critiques of his game, and he's got limitations, but he's growing, catching the ball cleaner with a bigger catch radius. He's never going to be a star and remains best as a number three in an Arthur Smith type of offense. But this is one of football's good dudes making plays. Someone who just loves playing football, reportedly emotional when the crowd was chanting his name mid-game. It's good tape and a great story. I can't wait for his next big moment. Be sure to follow us at SteelersDepot.com and check out episodes of The Terrible Take every day at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. And check out the terrible podcast with myself and Dave Bryan every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday.